Hello, my friends and health warriors. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive deep into the world of wellness and nutrition. My name is Nikolai Ninev. I am a certified food expert and pharmacist. Today we are talking about the science-based health benefits of natokinase. Are you in constant search for natural ways to support your health? For many centuries, the realm of natural healthcare has valued unique ingredients from our planet and one such key player steeped in history is natokinase. But what exactly is natokinase, and what can it do for you and your wellness journey? Navigating through the world of health supplements can sometimes feel like trespassing into a labyrinth of complex terms and conflicting opinions. Hence, our mission today is simple to hone in on comprehensive, easy-to-understand information about natokinase. We'll dive into its exceptional health benefits, potential side effects, and essential precautions that you should keep in mind. Join us as we take this journey of discovery, because enhancing your health awareness is the first positive step towards optimal wellness. From soybean to supplement, understanding what natokinase is. You may be wondering, what exactly is natokinase and why is it gaining recognition in the realm of medicine? Natokinase is an enzyme derived from natto, a traditional Japanese food made from fermented soybeans. The fermentation process is initiated by adding the bacterium Bacillus subtilis natto to boiled soybeans. The resulting product, natto, has a unique smell, sticky texture, and strong flavor and is a staple in many Japanese diets. Natokinase is a proteolytic enzyme, meaning it has the ability to break down proteins. In particular, it is known to be effective in breaking down fibrin, a protein involved in blood clotting. In supplement form, natokinase is often used for its potential health benefits, particularly in relation to cardiovascular health. It is believed to help prevent and dissolve blood clots, thereby reducing the risk of heart disease and stroke. It may also help lower blood pressure and improve circulation. Despite its origin from soybeans, natokinase supplements typically do not contain soy allergens as the fermentation process breaks down the soy proteins. However, individuals with soy allergies should still consult with a healthcare provider before taking natokinase. The Production Process of Natokinase The production process of natokinase involves a series of steps. First, soybeans are soaked in water and then steamed or boiled. Once the soybeans are prepared, they are mixed with the Bacillus subtilis natto strain. This mixture is then allowed to ferment for approximately 24 hours at a temperature of around 40 degrees Celsius. This fermentation process allows the bacteria to proliferate and produce the enzyme natokinase. Following the fermentation process, the resulting natto is then subjected to a purification process to extract the natokinase. This involves a series of filtration and separation processes to isolate the enzyme. The purified natokinase is then dried and converted into a powder form for ease of use and storage. Decoding the Role of Natokinase in Cardiovascular Health Ever thought about how you can naturally keep your heart healthy and reduce the risks of heart diseases? Natokinase might just be the answer you're looking for. Natokinase has been studied extensively for its potential benefits in cardiovascular health. It's primarily known for its fibrinolytic activity, which is the ability to break down fibrin, a protein involved in blood clotting. This makes it a potential natural alternative for preventing and treating conditions related to blood clots, such as stroke and heart attack. Research has shown that natokinase can help improve blood circulation. It does this by reducing blood viscosity, which is the thickness and stickiness of blood. High blood viscosity can impede blood flow and increase the risk of clot formation. By reducing blood viscosity, natokinase may help promote healthier blood flow and reduce the risk of clot-related conditions. Natokinase also has the potential to lower blood pressure. Studies have found that it can act as an ACE inhibitor, which means it can block the action of angiotensin-converting enzyme, a substance that causes blood vessels to narrow and blood pressure to rise. By inhibiting this enzyme, natokinase may help to lower blood pressure and reduce the strain on the cardiovascular system. 
In a 2008 study published in the journal Hypertension Research, researchers found that natokinase supplementation resulted in a significant reduction in both systolic and diastolic blood pressure in subjects with prehypertension or stage 1 hypertension. The study suggested that natokinase could be a useful adjunctive therapy for managing blood pressure. Another study published in Nutrition Research in 2015 found similar results. Participants who took natokinase daily for eight weeks showed a reduction in both systolic and diastolic blood pressure. The researchers concluded that natokinase could be considered as a dietary supplement for preventing and treating hypertension. Despite its potential benefits, it's important to note that natokinase is not a cure-all for cardiovascular disease. It should be used as part of a comprehensive approach to cardiovascular health that includes a healthy diet, regular exercise, and medical supervision. Dissolving Blood Clots, the Thrombolytic Power of Natokinase Natokinase is a potent fibrinolytic, anti-clotting enzyme extracted and purified from a traditional Japanese food called natto. This enzyme has gained attention for its remarkable ability to dissolve blood clots, also known as thrombolytic power. It works by directly breaking down the fibrin, a protein that forms a mesh-like structure to create a clot, thereby aiding in the prevention and dissolution of harmful clots. Natokinase has been found to have fibrinolytic activity that is four times more potent than plasmin. Natokinase thrombolytic power is not limited to direct clot dissolution. It also enhances the body's natural ability to fight blood clots by increasing the production of plasmin and other clot-dissolving agents, including urokinase. This dual action makes it a potent tool in preventing and treating cardiovascular diseases associated with blood clots. Unlike some pharmaceutical thrombolytic agents, natokinase does not appear to have the risk of causing excessive bleeding. This is because it works in harmony with the body's natural clotting and fibrinolysis processes, maintaining a balance between clot formation and dissolution. However, it's important to note that while natokinase is generally considered safe, it can interact with certain medications, particularly those that thin the blood. Exploring Natokinase Potential in Alzheimer's Disease Prevention Natokinase has been studied for its potential role in Alzheimer's disease prevention. Alzheimer's disease is characterized by the accumulation of beta amyloid plaques in the brain, which leads to neurodegeneration and cognitive decline. Research suggests that natokinase may have the ability to degrade these beta amyloid plaques. In a study published in the Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry, natokinase was found to break down these plaques in a laboratory setting. This could potentially slow the progression of Alzheimer's disease and improve cognitive function. Natokinase may also help to improve brain function in people who have had strokes. Research shows natokinase holds promise in treating post-stroke cognitive impairment. In animal studies, it was shown to promote neurogenesis by increasing blood levels of the hormone irisin. Moreover, natokinase has been shown to improve blood circulation by dissolving blood clots and preventing the aggregation of red blood cells. Improved blood flow to the brain could potentially enhance cognitive function and slow the progression of Alzheimer's disease. However, it's important to note that while these findings are promising, most of the research on natokinase and Alzheimer's disease has been conducted in a laboratory setting or on animals. More research is needed to confirm these effects in humans. But in the meantime, enjoy your natto and keep an eye out for the latest research on this promising enzyme. What are the potential risks of taking natokinase? Natokinase has been extensively studied for its health-enhancing properties, but like all supplements, it isn't without a few potential risks. Based upon some research studies, like the one titled Toxicological Safety Assessment on the Safety of Natokinase Capsules, the occurrence of adverse reactions is generally low. However, few specific considerations should be noted. While beneficial for preventing blood clots, natokinase could potentially increase the risk of bleeding, particularly in individuals with bleeding disorders or those taking anticoagulant medications. For instance, it could potentially enhance the effects of drugs that reduce blood clotting, such as warfarin, leading to an increased risk of bleeding. It may also interact with antiplatelet drugs and nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, such as aspirin. 
Natokinase may also interact with natural substances with blood thinning properties. These include garlic, ginger, ginkgo, and fish oil. Similar to the interaction with blood thinning medications, the combination of these substances with natokinase could potentially increase the risk of bleeding. Another risk involves potential allergic reactions. As natokinase is derived from soy, individuals with soy allergies may experience allergic reactions when taking this supplement. Symptoms can range from mild, such as rash or itching, to severe, including difficulty breathing or anaphylaxis. Lastly, there is limited research on the safety of natokinase during pregnancy and breastfeeding. Therefore, to avoid potential risks, it's recommended that pregnant or breastfeeding women avoid using natokinase unless under the guidance of a healthcare professional. Understanding your optimal natokinase dosage. Understanding the optimal dosage of natokinase is crucial for maximizing its benefits and minimizing potential side effects. While there is no universally accepted dosage for natokinase, most studies have used doses ranging from 100 to 300 mg per day. These doses have been found to be effective in improving blood flow and reducing blood clot risk. However, the optimal dosage may vary depending on individual factors such as age, overall health, and specific health goals. It's important to start with a lower dosage and gradually increase it, monitoring your body's response. This approach allows you to identify the lowest effective dose and reduce the risk of potential side effects. If you're taking natokinase for the first time, it's advisable to start with a dose of 100 mg per day. Thank you for watching our video. If you've enjoyed this video and found it informative, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. And as always, if you have any questions or want to share your experiences, feel free to leave a comment down below. I love hearing from my viewers. Your feedback is invaluable and inspires me to keep creating informative content. Remember, your health is your wealth. Until next time, stay healthy, stay happy, and let nature's wonders amaze you. See you in the next video.